hi you people welcome back to my channel and if this is your first time of stumbling on this channel you are welcome to my space where i do skincare videos on a budget i take care of my skin but i'm not ready to break the bank so today's video is inspired by one of my amazing subscribers this subscriber of mine <coughs> excuse me requested that i do a review on skin light body lotion if you are that person who requested this video by the way, shout out to you and sorry for doing this video late. I know you asked for this video like two months ago. I'm very sorry. It slipped up my mind, off my mind. I just, it like, just occurred to me just lately that you, somebody asked for this review. I'm sorry for bringing it out to you late, but this is me doing it for you. By the way, if you are new to this channel and you haven't subscribed on this channel yet, subscribe to this channel yet, I don't know what you're waiting for. On this channel, we take care of our skin, but we are not ready to break the bank. So if you are a skin care lover, you are passionate about your skin, you want to keep a beautiful skin, a glowing skin, but you don't want to necessarily spend too much, then you quickly want to hit the subscription button and don't forget to turn on your notification bell when you subscribe. So let's get to our topic for today. We are talking about skin light body lotion. First things first, there are two types of skin light body lotions in the market. Do you know that? Yes, we have two types. We have one that they say skin, skin light. Mama Africa, Skin Light Cocoa Butter, which is a Mama Africa brand, and then Skin Light Body Lotion, which is the one I'm going to be talking about today. So I will do my best to insert it on the screen so you know the exact one I'm talking about. I am not talking about the Mama Africa Skin Light Cocoa Butter, no. I'm talking about the other one. The Mama Africa Skin Light Cocoa Butter, people say it's the European type. Yeah, it's the European and, and Skin Light, but I'm not going to be talking about that one today. I'm talking about the other one, which says... Sans bouton et sans tache noire. That is to say in English, no pimples. When you use this lotion, you're not going to have any pimples and you're not going to have any dark spots. Now, you're watching me, you want to know, I'm, I'm sure all you, some of you want to hear is, does it lighten the skin? Does it brighten the skin? What does it do to the skin? I understand you, but I'm going to start from the big, like first things first. We have to talk about the ingredients. Because even if it's lightening your skin, you want to be concerned, you want to be careful about the kind of ingredients you are using on your skin to lighten your skin, if you must lighten your skin. Now, this lotion, Skin Light, skin light Body Lotion, contains hydroquinone and carotene with vitamin E. Now, those are not all the ingredients in the lotion, but those are the, also, those are the active ingredients. Active lightening ingredient is carotene and, and hydroquinone. There are many other ingredients like glycerin, like water, of course, other basic ingredients which you will find in mostly all lotions. But the active lighting ingredients, hydroquinone and carotene. You might want to know if it's okay to use on your skin. Now, hydroquinone, there is no news that hydroquinone is a lightening agent. It lightens up the skin. It's okay to use on your skin if you know how to use it. It's okay to use it on your skin if you're not going to abuse it because prolonged usage of hydroquinone is going to end it's going to earn you a thin skin a skin with um with um white dots see the way i'm admiring my skin oh my god a skin with white dots a skin with white patches uh, a skin with green veins and stretch marks all those things you don't want to you don't want to have on your skin when you overuse hydroquinone based product that's what you are going to get so if you want to use this product i would advise you use it with caution and make sure you watch this video till the end to know what you can add into this lotion to calm down to to avoid some of these excess reactions on your skin because of hydroquinone now like i said it contains hydroquinone and then it contains carotene extract carotene as well is Carotene extra is just like the name implies, it's extracted from carrots and it helps to protect the skin from the sun. It helps to even out the skin tone. It helps with dark scars. It helps with pigmentations. It helps with dull skin and so on and so forth. So carotene is very much safe. If this lotion had just carotene, I would say yes. I would like give you, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, just go and get it and use it on your skin. But because personally, I don't really like using hydroquinone based products. Um, um, I wouldn't really use this product and by the way I haven't used it on my skin I'm sorry for not letting you guys know I haven't used it on my skin I believe in the past I have used the soap but not the lotion I've used the soap in the past but not the lotion and um, but the soap you don't you don't expect to get you don't expect to get a lot just by using a soap on your skin so 
I'm talking all every, every information I'm giving you on this on this video is based on my research and what the tip I'm going to give you is based on a little bit of experience you understand so this lotion contains hydroquinone and it contains carotene so if you want to use it go ahead and use it does it lighten the skin yes it is very very active in lighting the skin of course what do you expect because it contains hydroquinone and hydroquinone is a very fast lightener but it doesn't work on every skin mind you there are some people that hydroquinone doesn't work on their skin like some people they have to use steroids 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 steroid for them to work remember hydroquinone is different from steroids hope you know that so this product works of course like every other product it's not going to work on everybody's skin but it is an active lightening product which can lighten your skin like sharp 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 that is if it's going to work on you it also has it has an oil if you want to overactivate it go ahead and put the oil depending on what you want to achieve on your skin now if you are asking me is it safe to use or is it not safe to use I've already told you you will just have to make your decisions yourself make your decisions yourself but if you want to know if it lightens the skin yes it lightens the skin does it give white dots stretch marks when thin skin that is something you want to expect with any lotion that you are using that contains hydroquinone you want to expect that you might not get it you might get it but when you're using products with, chem with, with ingredients like hydroquinone you having stretch marks and white dots shouldn't be strange to you but I'm not saying this product is going to give you that because skins are different. Some people use it and they don't get such reactions while some people use it and they get such reactions. So make your decisions wisely. Now, if you really want to use it because it is affordable, even though it contains hydroquinone, you want to use it because it's affordable for you more than some of the other brands that I've talked about on this channel. And you are scared of having white dots, you're scared of having white patches, you're scared of having stretch marks. I'm gonna be giving you out. I'm gonna be letting giving you a tip right now. But this tip, trust I'm honest, it might completely prevent the appearance of stretch marks and white dots to some people. Why to some people it might not completely prevent it, it might just help it a little bit. That is because skins are not the same, and whatever you have been using on your skin, and and how do I put it? Sometimes you have been using harsh chemicals on your skin and then you transition to another harsh chemical Your skin has already started being destroyed like you've already started destroying your skin and you move to another one It takes time For you to see the results completely like the effects of this tip I'm gonna be giving you completely manifesting on your skin if that makes sense by the way so just go ahead and get yourself by oil add into your lotion add into the and then what's it called skin light body lotion get bio oil get bio oil because bio oil helps with stretch marks to prevent stretch marks and to fade mild stretch marks if you don't have bio oil go ahead and get rescue oil that's also going to do the job but bio oil is what is highly recommended when you get your bio oil go ahead and get some vitamin e yes i know vitamin e is one of the ingredients that are in this lotion but you bear with me that when these manufacturers are doing it, they put just a little bit of vitamin E. So you can go ahead and add a little bit more into your lotion to calm down the effects of the hydroquinone in the lotion. Now, if you just want to have maybe a tone, it's a, a shade lighter, you don't want to get too light, go ahead and add coconut oil. Because coconut oil is going to really, really reduce the strength of the hydroquinone. Bio oil is going to help you with the stretch marks. It is going to help you with um, white dots, especially stretch marks. Coconut oil is going to help you to reduce the strength of the hydroquinone and to help you with white dots, like prevent the appearance of white dots. You understand? Because white dot basically comes up when you're using chemicals that are harsh and when your skin is thin, your skin is tired of the lightening product and then over when you over depigmented your skin over lighting your skin you start seeing white patches on your skin or popcorn like some people will call it so if you must lighten your skin do it with caution this is me i've lightened my skin before check my other videos you see how i used to be but you see the way i am right now 
I'm not complaining. I'm not white. I'm not light. I'm okay. I like it the way I am. Am I saying I'm not going to use lightening products on my skin? No. I'm still using them on my skin from time to time. But at the moment, I am skin building. I am taking care of my skin because at the end of the day, beautiful skin doesn't mean light skin. Beautiful skin doesn't mean dark skin. Beautiful skin is that skin you take care of. That skin you nourish. That skin you hydrate. That skin you pamper. You glow. You glow your skin. That's the whole essence of it. So if you find this video helpful, I'm going to be ending it here. If you find it helpful, give it a thumbs up. And then, if you want to see the other Mama Africa, which is the one that has cocoa butter, which apparently is milder than this one, then give this video a huge thumbs up, leave comments below, and turn on your notification bell so you can be notified when I upload the video. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that. Share my videos with your friends, and I will be seeing you in my next video. If you have any questions, leave comments below. I love you all so much, and thank you very much for always coming back to support your girl. Your girl is loyal. Bye-bye.